Right, welcome back. I'm out in Spain. Sun's in my eyes, which is nice. I've got 16 riders here with Spanish motocross holidays. We're going to do five different tracks. Today, as you can see, we're at CDG, but we're going to go to Red Sands and a few other tracks as well. So we're hopefully bumping into a few GP riders on the track. Little Bill's out here um, with his team. Catch up with him and um, have a cracking week out in Spain. That's it. Got this little weapon with me to get about. Test my farm as well. It's getting a bit better. Not too bad. Tidy little scar. But um, we're getting there. I think another week and I um, will be back on my big bike tearing it up. We're back again. I bet. How's your new your rider? Bike. Bit of a div. Yeah. What, more of a div than your last one? Yeah, more of a div than my last one. That though. takes a lot to do that and all. Yeah. Any tips for what I can teach my riders today? Yeah, elbows up, legs out like that. Like that. Is that what I need to do when I'm standing out watching with the hood? Yeah. The receding and the hairline don't blow off. Huh? <laughs> Is that what you're doing? Just yeah. keeping that on? Yeah, just keeping that on a little bit longer. <laughs> Oh, fair enough. Yeah, good thinking. Yeah. Can I have the track fee, please? Oh yeah, remember you the track. Remember, the, tra well. remember the track one we had uh, in um, Ramsey. Oh yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll pay you. Oh, where's, where's Tommy gone? Oh, he's gone home. No oh, what way. about the track fee? Oh yeah, yeah. It's a hundred euros a rider. Okay. I'll take out your wages. You Billy. still owe me that four fifty. Oh, we still got that. You nicked the engine. And you still owe me that. Remember that little road bike Kawasaki gave to me, and you sold. Well, we never had that. You did. Where's the specialised uh, bike that they we gave got you? Stolen. Oh yeah. You did. You did. <laughs> Everyone got stolen. Assen. Right. So Billy and Bobby are out there now. They're riding together so they can push each other. They're doing a session pyramid. So they got five laps. Then they're going to stop for a minute. Four laps. Stop for a minute. Three. Then two. Then one. Um, just a bit of sprint, really. See if he does a whip this lap. <laughs> Think he's less show now, less showboating. Last year he would have been trying to do whips. About the speed now, I like it, Bill. Who's fastest, Luke? Fix a match. Bobby yeah. a little bit. Yeah, Bobby had an edge. Tips for you both. Although, don't know if I'm racing 250s yet. No. Don't really want to say too much. So they're going again. Bobby's first, Billy's second. It's nice to watch them both because Bobby does some stuff good, Bill does some stuff good. Billy's a little bit too smooth, he needs to attack the track more and then sometimes Bobby's the opposite. Bobby attacks stuff a lot, quite hard on the throttle and gets a bit squirrely where Billy's just that little bit too smooth. He needs to race. How are they doing boss? Yeah, sure I'm to do it, yeah. Are you alright? Is they doing alright? They're doing okay. Are you happy with them? A bit quicker than you were, but yeah. No yeah. chance. Much better, Bill. Bit of aggression. I like it. My riders are doing 21s. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> what, trust the process? Trust the process. We've got to get to, through the season is the, is the goal. Today's to motocross, 20 rounds. Get to the you are right, it's not all about today, is it? It's not all about today. Sometimes it feels like it is, and then you have to realise that it's not. It's about the long game. About the long game, yeah. And you've been in it the longest, the this longest game, haven't you, Steve? 35 years. <laughs> the longest years. reigning GP team in the paddock. Yeah. No one knows more about the long game than you, do they? No. <laughs> they don't look to be doing a lot down there. Watch. Was you learning how to earn easy money down there? Yeah. Stand there and go. Go on, lads, go on. He didn't even clap. No, he just. Guess a twirl in your new gear, Bill. I was going to say you could be an Italian, but more like with that pale skin, more like a Denmark sort of guy. Denmark? Yeah. <laughs> like Norwegian. <laughs> He's broke your helmet. He's broke it, he? he just broke my tooth. What happened to that tooth? Come Let's have a look. Dog ate it. Let's have a look. Give us a smile. No, 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 Jack's 
just doing this corner for us because he says he's doing it good. What do you reckon, Steve? Yeah, good. I think I'd probably do, what's his best lap time? 21. 21. I think I'd probably be 19. Yeah. Well, he's showed him their way at the last round of the I British. just <laughs> brought that up, Steve. <laughs> I couldn't have him here and not bring it up. Yeah. He was actually fast. I think he done a better lap time than me, didn't you? I did have the fastest lap. Keck's fastest lap. Yeah, he won a Keck's fastest lap award. Oh, he's after sponsorship now. Yeah. <laughs> I, I haven't redeemed it yet. Not, what do I get? Send, oh, have Send you not had it yet? No. I've got a used pair he can give you. Okay. Right, a quick interruption to the vlog because I'm giving away, courtesy of myself and Dirt Store, this 450 Kawasaki behind me. It's the one that I raced on at Manchester or attempted to race on. It's the actual bike that Cedric Subra has won on last weekend in the NEC Birmingham. To win, all you have to do is be at Wembley on the 24th. That's this Saturday coming up, the Arena Cross. And all you have to do is buy something from the merch stand. Anything. It might be croc gibbets, might be Arena Cross, hoodie, t-shirts, a program. That will put you into the draw and I'll give the bike away live on the second half of the show. That's it. It's as simple as that. You know what to do. Get yourself to Wembley. Go to the merch stand, buy something, and you can walk away with this bike worth £12,000. It's got all the parts on, it's fully loaded, and it's the 2024 Kawasaki, which is unbelievable. So day after day, been around the pool, and now we just, everyone's getting a bit bored, so pit bike wheelie comp. I quite like the exhaust pipe on my bike, and I'm worried it might be gone after this. We're not quite sure what the winner wins yet, but <laughs> let's go then. Wheelie comp, coming up. Contestant number one. We need to teach wheelie in next <laughs> tomorrow, don't we? You haven't seen me how to go yet, boy. Uh, what are doing, He's mate? just making a slight adjustment to the rear brake here to enhance the wheelies. <laughs> oh! Contestant number two. That was good, mate. <laughs> <laughs> no! I'm not worried about the mud guard, I'm worried about the pipe. Oh, it's got a bit of grass in it. <laughs> I knew this was going to end badly. I didn't even get it on the vlog. I didn't even get the crash on it. Get to the rear brake. Something happened to the rear brake. Can't then, next man up. At least you can't snap the rear mug off. Oh, yeah. But this is your favourite for the win. I got my money on him. Right, we've had a, a bike incident. Mud guard's gone. Pro circuit pipes, pretty much. Uh, I don't want to swear on here, but pro circuit pipes not looking good either. He's been disqualified, that contestant. runs contestant number three now. Oh, oh. Oh, we got skill. You're right. What do I win? Man can wheelie. What do I win? You win nothing. He's going to win something. Right, yard designs. We need a real plastic kit for this. <laughs> a new sticker, please. Oh, no. Contestant number four. Just done his air for the vlog. Ready to go. Go on, Jamie. Yeah, he's quite good at wheeling, but... um. Some people just can't perform when the camera comes out. Attempt two. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I think we've had a win. We got a new leader. Got quite a big crowd building up now. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I thought you was going to go through the villa wall. You got to slow it down. Slow down. Right, go. I'm worried he's going to hit my uh, Fiat 500, mate. The Ferrari park just there, second row in. Fully comp. Oh, oh I put down. Disqualified. Yes, Your foot went down. It's the disqualification. Hold on. Oh, he's done it. Yeah. <laughs> Good game, man, wasn't it? Is that my trophy? Win a free mug up. It goes lights, camera, action when I step into the limelight. Easily adapted to the highlight. Dressed to impress like it's prime night. 
And when you live in top shelf, you know you gotta set the bar high Had the same dreams since we was kids Big chips, big cars, and even bigger cribs Never thought that it would happen just the way it did Fast forward that now, it's just the way we live Let's go food Right, I've just spotted a couple of Grand Prix riders So I'm gonna go over there, film them Guadalini, Jacoby, see if I can get a little bit of footage. There he is, legend. How are we looking, man? We're looking good. How are we, mate? How's the tube? I've come to film you. Nah, no way. I saw you, I've got a camera, I said, my man. You reckon top 10 is possible or not? Top five, we need Top podium. Five. We, we need podium, it. podium. How's the lap time on that one? 45 9, not too bad. Is that good? That's pretty good. So what's your role? Coach. coach. Oh, your coach? Yeah. A factory coach? You factory yourself? coach. Need results. Need results. You've been around a fair bit. Yeah, Who's little bit. your favourite? Still Ben or not? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I love him. getting into this all for your viewing pleasure running around filming other riders when I should be coaching oh, <laughs> nearly got run over by a motorbike but um yeah just working grafting Ruth just said you're gonna go to another track now for the third <laughs> moto <laughs> three tracks in one day right last day the whips going strong this one probably not so much. Geez up. What's that then? Alright. Big week, isn't it? <laughs> Dislocated the shoulder in the swimming pool. Couple of days off the bike. Back on your bike for the last day. Well, what else have we done this week? Anything good? Oh, it's just <laughs> women to take my life. That's <laughs> good, wasn't it? Yeah, of course. Beautiful show. Right, let's have a look. We've had an engagement this week. Yeah, boy. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Now it's been nice meeting you both. And you, sir. Like the sound people. Thank you very much, sir. Do you want to tell them how they done it? What? <laughs> a Burger King in a burger. <laughs> well, that wasn't the plan, was it? No. That was third option. <laughs> Last option. How are we, boys and girls? Good. Feeling better, better today? Yeah, definitely feeling a lot better. Man's repping. All the gear? Yeah, boy. We're tired, we're broken, we're ready to go. Day five. Done too much riding. So our last day coaching, we're at Carlet, and I thought, as I've been out here coaching for the five days, I'll give you some tips on the vlog. I'll get Ash, whose holiday company is Spanish Motocross Holidays, to film me while I take the riders through a little section. We're gonna do two today because they've been riding all week and a lot of them are tired. So this one's gonna be going through the ruts and hitting a jump. And um, the second session of the day will be going through a section of waves and then hitting a few jumps um, just to try and get them carrying that momentum a little bit more and um, feel more comfortable through the ruts and picking the front wheel up over the waves. I messed up in slow mode and Ash messed up pressing the camera button but what I wanted them to do, the slower guys when it's a righty section, to pick their rut, look past it, make sure in the right gear, the right body position and now carry their momentum through the line and the faster guys I wanted them to use their body and their gears really over it but not getting too far back that they pull the bike off to the side use your core and you get into that attack position so the bike can come up and you can drive forward then they can suddenly jump up Accident, committed to the camera game. Big problem. I feel like we've just made a bit of progression, haven't we, Rob? Yeah, definitely. Much better. Yeah, good. You've got a smile on your confident. face again. I have, yeah, I didn't an hour ago, did I? No. Yeah, I feel loads better. Was... Right, so what some of them have been doing there, and they found the biggest difference is, they was all hitting these doubles and the tabletops in third. And the problem you have when you're in that lower gear is every time you get on the power, 
it's so sensitive. The smallest movement on the throttle has a huge reaction. So you're already nervous, then they get in that nervous position with their knees slightly further forward, their arms pushing back, and then every touch of the throttle has a big reaction. They end up going up the takeoff, shutting off, and then at the top giving it a little blip because they're scared to keep the throttle on all the way through the takeoff. And then when they've gone up to fourth, they found that they're in a much easier gear, it's not so sensitive, it's not so reactive, so now they can keep the throttle on, be a lot smoother, and they have confident using the throttle because the reaction that happens if you do give it a little bit more throttle or a little bit less throttle is much less. Then that gives them confidence to then get in the correct position over the jump. Um, so for all the guys then, they was all one gear too low, apart from the couple of the faster guys, but everyone else was in third. So I've had them come out the corner, some of them are still in second, they're going up two gears, getting into fourth, the bike's driving forward, they're in their right body position, and now they're just floating over that jump. They're able to get their speed ahead of time and carry a constant throttle all the way through it. So um, none of them were jumping that jump, and now they're all jumping it, all way happier, and got smiles on their faces. So um, happy days. How much better is that? So much better. You're happy now, aren't you? Yeah, happy. You listen. Oh, frustrated. Yeah. Good man, well done. Well, I was going to ask you to take a picture of us all. Oh. We don't, uh, don't want one picture? with you in it. I thought we were all going to line up together. <laughs> well, I've got to set the time, haven't I? Hey. Yeah. I've got long fingers. Thanks for coming along, guys. Thank you. Were you learned anything or not? Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> Carry on, Tom. Time to shine. No, last two days are the best days. I learned a lot. Um, just quite hard staying with everyone and having to talk to them all week but a bit more on got a lot more on the trip Sean especially but it's all right isn't it? he's a good lad isn't he get paid and go home that's it yeah. <laughs> no one's paying you nothing yeah.